taste challenge at the damn bar. In this corner, hailing from Newport, Oregon, coming in at 6.7% ABV, we have Bat Squatch. Hailing from this corner, Hailing from Kalamazoo, Michigan. Coming in at 7% ABV, we have Two Hearted IPA from Bells. Let's get ready to go. Welcome back to the Dam Bar for another Big B Blind Taste Challenge. And boy, this is a new, unique one for sure. Um, I've had both of these. Um, I haven't had this one in quite a while, and I had this one a little while back when they came in the variety pack. Um, I, I don't know if they're really similar, but they are both IPAs. This one's a hazy IPA, but I think this one might be kind of, you know, an IPA too. So it's not like these are ones I drink on the regular. I do know... I do like this one a lot. I have rated this one an A+, plus, Big B Beer Review Grade. This one, I believe, was rated a C+. Plus. Yes. And a, and uh, But that's what this is about, too. I want to see how good my, my own grading skills are. If I end up liking this one more, then obviously I'm not that good at grading uh, IPAs. We shall see. And I mean, see if I, you know, testing my own palate and all that to see how good I am. This is a... A good moment of truth here because this one obviously had the a plus but if i'm mistaken i like this one quite a bit i gave it a c plus and but i created this one a long time ago too and i was just handing out a pluses like they were nothing you know <laughs> so for those that don't know this is a true blind taste challenge i go outside texas tea comes she pours them into one of these glasses why does that one look so dirty it's an old glass. It just came out of the dishwasher. Yeah. Anyways, she'll pour it into one of these two glasses. She'll write down what glass they're poured into, you know, and then she'll cover it up with this. And then she'll hide that, obviously, and all that. When she's done with all that, she rings the bell. I come back inside and put on the blindfold and do the true blind taste challenge. All right, time to do it. Let's get it on. One hazy and one not? Yes, and one exploded and one didn't. Oh. Oh, I remember that. I think I remember that. That was a two hearted it exploded because I remember both those hearted ones exploded. Oh, God, did you get it all cleaned up? Yeah, it got, yeah I got it. You already got it? Okay. Sorry about that. I didn't even, I forgot it's been a little minute since I did the review on it. Forgot those things explode when they get opened. I got most of it poured in the cup, so. That's all that matters. As long as you got the mess cleaned up too, you said. I did, yes. You're the greatest Texas tea. All right. Here I go. Starting with the right hand, get on the smell first. Mmm. Smell pineapple. Hops. Yeah. 
Ah. Whoa. That's freaky. All right. Pineapple. But this one, I think, has a little bit more of a citrus smell. More of a, an orange smell. But they really smell very similar. All right. Salute. Oh, wow. Hoppy. Bitter. Not bad. Up to him. Salute. Holy shit. Holy shit. Hoppy and bitter. Man. This is going to be harder than I thought. And you said that one explode, well, either way, but they, they did, they look different. They, yes, they are different. That's the main reason I'm blindfolded. Uh, man, these are, I can't believe it how fucking similar these are. I was not expecting this. Holy shit. One's hazy, one's more clear. These are both really good. I mean, wow. Um, I was expecting it to be like easy, but this is not. Would you say, well, I'll ask afterwards, ma'am. All right, let me just do some real, get into it here. Wow. Okay. I think I like this one the best. This one just has a little bit more flavor that's different and that I like, you know. I can't believe how fucking similar these two are. I was not... I, I thought this was going to be a one, you know, a quick, easy, this is wow, blowing my mind how hard this is, but I think I like this one the best, and I can't, I mean, the grades are so bad, I'm already, I'm already disappointed in myself, because both of them should be very similar, and they're actually far apart in grades. Wow, I might need to have to do a re-review of, of one or the other, depending. This one has a little bit more of a better taste. But they both taste almost exactly the same with that hoppiness, the citrus, you get the pineapple, and a little bit of a piney finish on both of them. You see, now I drink this one, I like this one more. Crap. Oh my God, this is, oh my God. <laughs> I, I want to say it's a tie. Yeah, this one, you know, this one seems to be even a little bit more bitter, which throws it off, whereas this one isn't, but this one has a little bit more better flavor. I'm disappointed in myself. I'm picking this one. I think it's Bat Swatch. Because I do like this one a little better. Alright. Here we go. Son of a bitch. Right, the one that exploded on me. <sighs> With what Texas T just said. 
This is the one that exploded, meaning it was the two-hearted. The Big B Beer View Gray Glass. The two-hearted wins. Uh, wow. 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 I think I'm going to have to do a revisit review of this. Or raise the grade on this one. I don't know. I think bring it back down. I don't think it was. I shouldn't have been handing out A pluses so easily. But I might do another review on the Bat Squatch here. See, when you can see things, they taste different. But blinded, I got to hand it to Bell Stu Harden. The, it won, and I am debating on even having this air on YouTube. <laughs> wow, what I'm going to do, you know. Not everybody's perfect, but I need to tighten my game up. Man, I was not expecting this to be like this. I thought it was going to be an easy blind taste challenge. It'd be fun, get drink two beers. Wow! I'm stunned. I mean, I'm really, really stunned. All right. Well, let me know in the comments below what you guys think. If y'all have any uh, blind taste challenges you'd like to see me try, let me know. If I can find the beers, I will definitely try them because these are a lot of fun. And wow, I'm still just like, I can't believe that they were that similar and that hard to tell. And, wow. I just, wow. There you have it. Two hearted wins. Hope you all enjoyed watching this as much as I enjoyed making it. And drinking it if so hit that like button you want to see more of these blind taste challenges and my future reviews which i'm going to have to do a revisit of this i'm going to have to i mean or i might just do a reevaluation grade it'll be a quick easy video because that one if it's as good as this one and i just recently did that one not long ago and gave it a c plus i have to reevaluate that one I, wow anyways i hope to catch y'all here at the damn bar to make sure you do, hit that uh, subscribe button and the notification bell and share. It doesn't cost anything. And I hope to see you all here at the damn bar for the next one. Till next time, salute and happy days.